Hello everyone and welcome to another video today. Today we're back in spin tires and we're doing a bit of a different video today. Um basically we're gonna be exploring this new map called Plans 4x4 map and I hope I pronounced that correctly. So we've got a bunch of cars here. Um we've got a Ford Ranger, a Suzuki Samurai uh, no Suzuki SJ 410, Suzuki Vitara, Toyota Hilux, Jeep Cherokee, and I believe that's a Ford F350, and of course, a very, very pristine looking Land Rover Series 3. Um, it's got these nice fat wheels on it, roof rack, these are all modifications that I put on the vehicle. It comes as your bog standard Series 3. Originally, um, when you first spawn the vehicle in, but it has got some amazing modifications and just looking at it, I just felt the need to do a um, to do a showcase on it sometime in the future. But then again, though, it may seem pointless doing a showcase on it if I've already drove it around this map. But without further ado, we are going to jump straight on into it and take this beautiful Series Three around the map. Which I am actually really looking forward to it. So we don't want to actually be going that way. We're going to turn around, spawn in a bit of an awkward position with this. So it's got a lot of power. This car, the uh, green. It's not even different when even on. It's constant. It's got constant four-wheel drive, which is pretty cool. Um, your average Land Rovers. They, they don't actually have that anymore, no, that's that's wrong with them to say average Land Rovers tend to have that, but no they don't. Um, so, oh this looks pretty, pretty fun. So we're just going to go over that. Now I'm not, I'm not even going to look at the map, or I'm going to try not to look at the map, I'm literally just going to go wherever it takes me. So we're going to go left up here I think, it's pretty fun. See if the Land Rover can make it up. If not, we'll come back down and turn around. But I'm not gonna lie, it's making very nice ground to start with. And it's only in automatic. <laughs> so he's actually climbing. Believe it or not. I'm gonna try and take the outline the track whereas anybody else would probably go on the inside but it's fairly rocky right there so I don't think these fat wheels will agree with the rocks in my opinion come on it's getting there you know what, let's stick the handbrake on chuck it down into low box set off again. See if we can make it. Yeah, low box is a lot nicer for it. Let's try taking the middle one because that rock would be a bit tedious. Maybe, 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 maybe we can get on it. I can literally see it. It's teasing me. Mm. I don't know. No, I think we're gonna have to just quickly winch it up. But it's actually got a lot further than I thought it would. I didn't think it'd have made it that far at all. Drag it up here. So now it can go for itself. So we're gonna go down this massive hill now about well it's not too big but it's about the so oh my god yeah it is. Right, so we're gonna have to be nice and careful going down here guys. It's very steep. <laughs> Good job the brakes are reliable. 
No, they're actually quite terrible, but it's going. I want to try and take that line. Oh no, that's not happening. Started it more nice and then going diagonally, keep cornered at an angle. We now steep the line that I've done. It's made it. Let's just see where we get to now then. So, it's like we're going to end up crossing the water. Um, this is another route now. We'll have to cross the water. It doesn't look too weak, so that's okay. Hmm, <laughs> got some more rocks here. See, I don't like the look of the rocks when it comes to using a long wheelbase, land rover. I mean, it's never going anywhere in that sort of situation. I'll try to take that one. Is that a route? Is that taking take you out? Looks like it does, it might not. Oh wow. Right. Let's see if we can get around here this way. It looks like we can just drive it around here and then get around uh, possibly. I don't actually think you're supposed to do that. I'm just going to drop right there. Turn right, left even. Try to make his way up this hill. Possibly. Perhaps we'll get on that to where we be. It was probably the wrong choice to come this way, not going to lie. Attempts to reset to the garage and take the other room. So I just reset and I'm just gonna go the other way because, like I say, I'm not gonna look at the map, but it doesn't seem like a very good way to go in a vehicle like I have. So we're gonna forget about going that way and go over the bridge this time. It should maybe be a bit more suited for this. Um, series 3. And then maybe a bit more fun as well. So we shall, we shall see. We'll see if I'm right or not. I'm more likely going to be wrong, but the possibility. We may be right. Ooh, a bit of damage there, but nothing major. Across, see what little side tracks we get. I don't like the automatic on there because it doesn't really work very well. This is more like a race track, this bit. I mean, looks like I should be getting some air on it. This looks like the type of map that I could probably spend a fair bit of time on. Got a track off to the side. Nope. Keep on going to a fire one. We can possibly take. Depending on the look at it. I think with that Ford Ranger and the um, Baja F three fifty I've got back back at the um, at the garage. I think it'd be quite fun to take that on here with some speed. It might be a bit interesting. It's taken a while to actually find another track. I mean, you think there'd be a few just next, you know, like at the side leading off the hill, isn't it? I don't know, maybe I've missed a few. I don't think I have. Hill there. 
Here we go. Looks like there's a split here. Ooh. No? Oh no, maybe I'm wrong. Everything's on the two different brains? Not entirely sure. So this seems like to be a bit of a wide and dry track. To be a proper track. Something more like a little connector road, connection road to get to other tracks. What's that? I can see something um, ahead. Is that something interesting? This looks pretty cool. Is this. Can we. Oh, that would be so much better if there was like little hill tracks to go up and down. That would be pretty sick. But, oh well. Right, I'm not going to unlock those trucks, I'm just going to carry on going. Oh, it looks like it's getting a bit muddy here. Should be interesting. Oh no. Looks like it should have been hogging. I'm just going to follow the tracks that have been made. See where it takes me. I feel like I should be sinking, but I'm not. Just keep on going. Ooh, lost it a bit there. See, now the mud's coming. I'm just going to keep on going. I think this Series 3 is liking it with both ends. It's really liking it going up and down with some of these little bumps. It wants to be in its comfort zone. It's feeling quite nice to drive on here. Quite a nice map list, but I feel like that space has been almost wasted. Oh, looks like this little mud track ends around here now. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Look like it did from a distance, but it's just the texture's loading. This is quite an interesting track. I don't know whether I'd like to explore this with something else. As well as this. Ooh. As well as this series, right? Maybe take some of that hills. So build a track of my own. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down a bit. <laughs> it's coping really nicely, actually. I weren't expecting it to do so well. Around here. So this. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna end it around that log up on the top of the hill, around that stump. Seems like a nice place to end the video. Um, it's been, it's quite nice as well. I wouldn't, wouldn't mind going and uh, 
exploring some more with some more vehicles. So the lineup that I have, all the vehicles back at the garage, I think that I'm going to actually do an almost a series on this map, exploring the map and driving around in different cars and seeing what can do what. So. Anyway guys, if you've enjoyed this video, please do not hesitate to drop a like down below. It really does go a long way and it means a lot and it gives me feedback on my videos and tells me what you guys actually like and what you don't like and therefore making me want to upload certain things and not some other things. And obviously I want to upload things that my viewers like. So anyway guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, like I say, drop a like. If you'd be kind enough to subscribe for more daily content like this that I provide, please do not hesitate. I hope you've enjoyed this video, guys. My name's been Tom, and I'll catch you in the next one.